Hey Veritas, um, I think I mentioned it to you in a comment in um, a video you made recently um, that you should check out Michael Dowd, D-O-W-D. Um, I actually went out and got his book today, um, Thank God for Evolution, How the Marriage of Science and Religion Will Transform Your Life and World, and uh, it's uh, a kind of evolutionary spirituality that he presents, and uh, I ask that you at least um, watch some of his videos on YouTube, maybe even go to his website, I think it's thankgodforevolution.com. Um, check out what he has to say, because um, he rejects the intelligent design creationism, whether they're two separate things or not. He rejects both movements, uh, because I think he rightly points out that both of them assume the same picture, the same general picture of the natural world, as materialism does, um, in that it is a mechanical world which God has withdrawn from, and you know the materialists would say, well, God didn't withdraw; there just is no God. But there's still both materialism and the creationist picture of this created world is that it is an artifact; it is devoid of meaning. But in the case of the creationist, has meaning because God, this transcendent being, created it. Uh, and said that it was good. Um, Michael Dowd has more of a, uh, an imminent spirituality or an imminent view of God. So in that sense, it's sort of uh, it's a kind of panentheism, you could say. But to my mind, um, there's nothing spiritual about intelligent design or creationism at all. And to be a Christian and think that that version of the truth somehow uh, strengthens your 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 faith or your view and place your view in and, and view of and place in the cosmos. Uh, I, I don't see that. I think uh, a really rejuvenating and empowering spirituality involves seeing God as imminent in this natural world, not seeing the world as a mechanism, whether it's infinitely complex or not. Um, I think we should reject the mechanistic view altogether. So that means materialism, creationism, intelligent design, all of that goes out the window and instead we embrace this, you know, radically evolutionary picture where the universe is constantly creating itself and in fact the creation is not an event which occurred, you know, if you think literally 6,000 years ago or, or even 14 billion years ago. The creation moment is still ongoing. The universe is not done creating itself. God, if you will, is not done creating itself through us, through all the other animals and beings and, and, and life in this universe. It's still an ongoing uh, story. Um, so check out Michael Dowd's book or just watch some of his videos. Uh, I think you may learn to appreciate the perspective he's coming from where evolutionary science is not rejected uh, but in fact seen as an affirmation of one's faith in a God who is continuing to create through the creatures in this world. So check it out. Let me know what you think. Take it easy.